the arrest of Samsung Group Chief J.Y. Lee has sent shockwaves through South Korea. He is the highest profile business figure caught up in the corruption scandal swirling around President Park Kun hae Lee is accused of bribing a close friend of the president to gain government favours. He faces charges of bribery, embezzlement, hiding assets overseas and perjury. This business expert says it sends a message. With the owner of the company being arrested, it'll mean not only financial losses for Samsung, but also social costs as well. However, with this, South Korea is showing that it will not accept wrongdoing. So in the long term, there is a chance that South Korea's credibility will be raised. Shares in Samsung Electronics slipped but ended the trading session down less than half of 1%. There are concerns that Lee's arrest could create a leadership vacuum and hamper Samsung's ongoing restructuring plans. On the streets, there were mixed reactions. This woman said the court should have ordered his arrest when the prosecutors tried before. She said there was enough evidence this time around and the law is fair. Well done to the special prosecutor's team. <laughs> But this man called the arrest a shame. He said the original focus of the special prosecution was the president. But I think because they couldn't find much on her during the investigation, they've arrested Lee. And I think this will have a huge effect on our country's economy. The Samsung Group accounts for about 20% of South Korea's economy, employing around half a million people. Lee is the de facto boss since his father, who was himself twice convicted of financial crimes, suffered a heart attack two years ago.